being joined now by the star of Neighbours, Winners and Losers and UK's Heartbeat, it's Blair McDonough. Thank you very much. Thanks for joining us. Good to be here, guys. Thank you for having me. Now, I've got, I'm just going to refer to my notes to this. Let's, let's just go through this career, or at okay. least one part of it. Uh, you appeared on Celebrity Sing B, OK? On Sky One's The Match. You were fourth eliminated on BBC Two's Safari School. Correct. You were the third celebrity sacked from ITV's Deadline. Correct. You appeared on ITV's Soap Star Super Chef. Yep, did that. And you ran <laughs> second in Big Brother. Correct. So many reality competitions. Yeah. When are you going to win one? <laughs> no. Well, I've always, I've always, I've always said to anyone, it's very difficult coming second. You know, it's it's just a skill that you have to have. It was. Uh, yeah. There's some good ones in there though. <laughs> yeah. Wow. I didn't do a singing. Did I do a singing one? I don't think yeah, I did singing day. No. Oh, I did too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Can you I went out real early in that one. That was a shit one. Can anyway. I write your resume for you if you yeah, like? You can. Yeah, you can. Can you, can you sing? Hey? Can you sing? Anyone can sing in the shower, can okay? <laughs> <laughs> Four beers and I'll sing anything you want. Did you have the shower on set? Uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. You've been quoted as saying that Neighbours was your university. Yes, exactly. Uh, right. Is that because your character lived in a share house <laughs> and, you, <laughs> and, you, and your housemate was always trying to pick up something like and easy. <laughs> yeah, that, that as well as we were, you know, pretty much sharing everything that came in the front door, so that was good. In Neighbours, you lived in the House of Trouser. <laughs> One, when they came out with House of Trouser, I actually still don't quite get it. I'm like, House of Trouser? There was three of us. <laughs> Where's your grammar? And then you also trained in that celebrity show uh, Safari School, was Correct. it? Correct. We did have to share a room and, of course, I got to share the room with down the gay guy on the show. But it was fun. We had a lot of, we had a lot of fun. It, we were very close. Did you ever have to handle a house of trouser snake? No. House of... <laughs> you really have read between the lines. <laughs> I try not to go back there. I go forward. I yeah. go backwards. No, I'm going to embarrass you by saying that you were actually judged uh, 20... Who magazine's 25 yeah. most beautiful people? Mm. Now... Uh, I think they were really <laughs> scoping the bottom of the barrel that year, but it's just... Yeah, it's awkward. I'm just wondering, though, because on Big Brother, you obviously showered nude. Mm. Uh, on Winners and Losers... Watch it much, did you? Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> Got it on loop that, in your apartment. That's what it just... It's You're all over the internet. That's what you are. <laughs> <laughs> on, hey, I haven't finished yet. Uh, winners and Losers, <laughs> you bared your butt. Yeah. yeah. And then in Dancing with Your Stars, you yeah. danced topless. Pretty much. Were you worried that you were giving the uh, the judges at Who too much information? <laughs> <laughs> but if they still classified me beautiful after that, I'm all right with that. You know? <laughs> if they said 25, 25 most, you know, you could probably do better, you know, <laughs> then I would have been a little bit disgruntled. Winners and Losers, such a huge reaction, and also in the UK as well. Do I smell another panto? Oh, <laughs> do you know? Have you ever seen a panto? I love Australians who really rip the piss out of pantos. Do you know what they are? No, no idea. <laughs> but I'm going to give him shit about it. <laughs> You're red hot. Um, yeah. Pantos are incredibly satisfying jobs because they're very hard to do, but also you entertain so many kids, and when you see just how much fun they have, I would do one in a heartbeat, but. And you did Heartbeat Excuse as well? Pun. Yeah, thank you. Thank <laughs> Sliding you. that one Sliding in there? Sliding that one in, but yeah. Um, yes, Heartbeat as well, that was fun. That was, you know, spending, you know, two or three weeks in probably the coldest spot on earth. Oh, oh wow. Yeah, <laughs> acting as an Aussie sheep shearer, it was really tough. <laughs> <laughs> In, in, the a, in a pub. In the no, in a pub. <laughs> OK, you didn't have your time. No, I, I think I did at one stage. <laughs> anyway. Now, Blair, thank you so much for coming on the show. And I guess we have... There's only one way to end this. It's time to go. Oh. <laughs> no, seriously, You've thank you so much. Research. Thanks it's for having me. I've had a ball. Privilege. It's been great. Thanks, and, man. you know, let's, let's hang out more. <laughs>